Peace. Bam. Bam. <laughs> Happy now. Now is the vibrate, of course. Not going too far in the future. Not going too far in the past. Right now. What's funny is I was about to, like, as far as like evolving my videos and the way I do things, I was about to stop my intro until it actually helped me one day. And I was like, all right, damn, the little intro do come in handy. But just the fact of hearing, you know, being in the now or now is the vibrate, like just by hearing that on repeat, it just kind of helped to keep that subconscious in check. Like, you know, remember, stay in the moment, you know, but I want to speak on the ascension process and how this ascension process is for a whole organism and not just one set of organisms, you know, or is it, it's not for one set of, of beings, you know what I'm saying, within the organism, the ascension is for the whole organism. So, you know, a red blood cell can't be in my body like, yeah, you know, the ascension, all the red blood cells ascending, you know, all the other blood cells ain't gonna, ain't gonna get the knowledge, all the other blood cells ain't gonna, and then, and then as that blood cell doing that, it's speaking it into existence and creating that tension, but you know, but red blood, like, oh no, look, I got, I got, a, I got iron in my blood, see the iron is what, magnify and amplify this and that you know what i'm saying i'm different and i'm you know but my point being <laughs> a message to my melanated brethren and sistren you know and realizing that this is a ascension process not only for you know melanated beings but for all things now let me show you, let me put an asterisk by that though. Because I'm speaking on it more in the sense of like, you know, melanated people really think that like everybody, like it's only, it's only, like this ascension is only for people who have visible melanin. You know what I'm saying? And that that's a lie. That's not, that's not true. But, <laughs> the asterisk come in because melanin is in mostly everything on our earthly, you know, on this earthly plane and in our earthly existence, you know, to a certain extent, it is about, you know, melanin and about the vibration of melanin raising, you know what I'm saying? Because again, you got some people who may not, you know, visibly look brown or black or whatever may you know visibly look like a caucasian person but they have neuromelanin and have melanin in their body and they're going to experience the ascension process but they may have a few things uh that may not have melanin in it you know what i'm saying <laughs> a few uh things people places the things that you know may lack melanin and may not, you know, may not ascend or be a part of the process because think about it like this, you know, it is an ascension process for a whole organism, but the whole organism is only keeping the good vibrations, you know what I'm saying? So say for instance, I'm saying this ascension is for this whole organism, but say for instance, there's some people that's, you know, transitioning, you know, passing away, in which again, they'll come back and be a part of the ascension process later down the line or, you know, a, a later part of the process. But, you know, it's some things that are, are getting eliminated from Earth in order for the growth to really take place. So it is the ascension of one organism, but some of the organisms or some of the things that's on the organism are not organic and meant to, you know, to go along with the ascension, you know, if that makes sense. But, you know, on that, on that level, though, it's like, again, the ascension process is for one whole organism. So say, for instance, I'm detoxing, I'm drinking water. So all, like, all my, all the, uh, the melanocytes, all the, 
the parts in the body is, you know, that deals with energy and that's, you know, that's good, that's uh, beneficial. All the, all the organs and cells that's beneficial to my being, they're going to ascend, you know, along with me detoxing and, detoxing and dieting. Those cells are going to, you know, it's going to ascend with me. But they have some cells in my body that's not even trying to see a detox and not trying like, it's like, detox, like, like, we ain't even trying to deal with that, you know. It's those beings or those cells that, you know, won't be a part of the, you know, the, the process on a physical level as far as like, you know, the ascending process. So like, yes, we all are one organism, but some of the cells within this organism are cancerous or, you know, they're not, they're not, uh, they're not familiar or organic to the organism, you know what I'm saying? So therefore, it's kind of threatening to the ascension process. But again, this is this is not about no one race, no one peoples. This is about a, a organism, you know what I'm saying? From Earth to our solar system, you know what I'm saying? To things going on within our being, you know, as above, so below. But this is a ascension process of one organism. So you know. We got to realize that because another message which has been strong and I'm seeing it through a lot of people is to make everybody realize to stop that hate no matter what color you are. You know what I'm saying? Like you shouldn't be looking down upon any being or, or thinking you're better than any being. All right. So what your melanin make you jump high and run fast? That still don't make you better than somebody that may lack a little melanin. You know what I'm saying? Like it's getting to that point now where we got to recognize like to stop being because that's a form of ego a lot of people don't realize it that holding on to your racial constructs is still you know and to a certain extent when you're holding on to it too much and it starts to create separatism you know what i'm saying but this is an ascension process for a whole organism it's not just for the red blood cells this is not just for the white blood cell. This is not an ascension just for the stomach. It's not just for the heart. It's just not for the pineal gland. This is an ascension for the whole body, the whole organism. But like I say, there are some, some things in my body. So say, for instance, after I ate a candy bar earlier, you know, then of course, once I'm, when I'm detoxing, that candy bar is not going to be a part of the ascension. You know, anything that's GMO is not going to be a part of the ascension necessarily, you know. Like any any uh, non-organic organisms, non-organic cells or, you know, uh, beings are not going to be part of this ascension process, you know, uh, because it may be something that's outside of, you know, of the physical being. And, 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 and as I'm saying that, please realize, though, again, how the vastness of it, speaking on this point in general, yes, but of course, source is everything. Source is, the, source is cancer, source is the, the cancerous cells, source is the candy bar and the, the sugar that's bad for us, the salt that's bad for us, that's source too. You know what I'm saying? But I'm talking again, back to you know, the, the, the true nature and the in sourcing the aspect of the light, you know what I'm saying, and the high vibrations and the ascension process, you know, that part of source is not dealing with its other part of itself, you know what I'm saying? Like it is time to ascend and clean the, the, the physical and the, the uh, spirit body, you know what I'm saying? The the physical and the non physical is on the ascension, so but that's basically it. Matter of fact, that's what I wanted to see. If I hit all my little bullet points. Which, yeah, that's all I want to just display, you know, and just uh, get out to people that it it is a ascension of, you know, one organism. Matter of fact, now it's getting more important than ever to make everybody realize that we are one organism. It's time, like Pimp C says, it's time to get a, get a bread truck and get up off this crumb shit. <laughs> excuse my diction <laughs> but you know it's like bro it's time to really embrace the truthfulness of our being because things are happening you know we 
time is showing itself to be the illusion that it is and things is moving you know what i'm saying so you want to be with the with the real righteous reality of the situation with our spiritual growth and i still be living that illusion like well it's about the rise of a certain peoples like only this set of people nah you know what i'm saying now nah, of course now nah, say for instance on the outside looking in because of the the melanin yes but it, it it's melanin on the inner level you know what i'm saying like a neuro melanin level and that's something that some people that may not have the skin melanin still do have so you know when you're going to look and thinking that somebody because they don't have the same skin color as you they're not going to sin or they like nah man it ain't about the color of a skin and all this you know and with that being said another thing too which i don't want to you know how could i say this doesn't mean uh I'm trying to think of a, a good way to, to say it without, you know what I'm saying? We come in together, but it doesn't mean to not stay aware of, like, you know, the the government bullshit and, and what they are trying to use to pull us together. You know what I'm saying? Like creating this new world order type of thing or, you know promoting things that are detrimental to uh to our spiritual growth on a connected you know what i'm saying like it's basically they gonna be throwing curveballs with us coming together so say for instance yes it's about us all recognizing that we're all one organism on that level but not in the eyes of the way the government is trying to make it happen you know what i'm saying same thing how i brought up population control like in essence, that is something that's natural and is not evil, you know what I'm saying? Like, that is something that is beneficial to to the planet, you know what I'm saying? Like, if the planet was obese, it wouldn't be able to function properly, you know what I'm saying? But the way that the, that you know, that the government and these people go about it, you know, I wouldn't agree upon, you know what I'm saying? But I digress. And again, you know, it's a ascension process. So see, Earth is a being that is detoxing its body. You know what I'm saying? Right now, Earth is detoxing. And Earth always been detoxing. You know what I'm saying? So just because you happen to be in one of the areas that it is detoxing, say via Houston or, you know, wherever you say, for instance, this weather and natural disasters hitting. And that's another thing, too. Uh, that's why I I didn't even do that video because I'm like, bro, it's just, I, I, I just, my spirit tired of baby fine humanity. Like, you know, like, of course, for people's humanity, I hope they're doing well in these, you know, physically in these storms and stuff. But, like, this is prophecy. What's meant is meant. So, you know, you're not going to see me like, oh, like, the, like nobody losing their life. Everybody is transitioning. Ain't not a, no soul is dying. You know what I'm saying? All these people from Houston to Katrina, all this, none of them ever died. You know, they transition, you know, and, and rightfully so. Because obviously, you know, they wasn't, they wasn't aware of what was going on in hindsight, so they end up in that position. Matter of fact, before I go, it's funny, it brings me to this lesson. Uh, speaking on fear. Matter of fact, nope. I'll make a video about it. I'll do a separate video about it. But, <laughs> but matter of fact, that's basically it. Just wanted to, you know, bring that forth more and more that it is an ascension process for an organism. And matter of fact, we like the last part of the organism to get online with this ascension process to to a certain extent like you know like other places in the galaxy are waiting for us to grow so they you know so we could connect on on that level because matter of fact another thing too where there's resources on earth you know different planets got different little resources things of this nature but if we still 
tripping out on each other as humans, you know, like you can't even deal with each other on a human level, then you'll never be able to deal with, you know, with the rest of the galaxy who looks way different from all of us, you know? So that's just something to keep in mind, you know? And again, uh, not, not, uh, not trying to make the come together situation like how the government doing, but how source, you know, is orchestrating and how it's really meant to go. You know? Not no new world order, every one government type of. And I fallen victim to their craziness, but <laughs> peace happen now. Now is the vibrate. Not going too far in the future. Not going too far in the past.